Welcome back to the channel, guys. Have I got a good one for you today. Let me tell you what. I've been working on this one for the last week. And this was a beautiful accident. Beautiful accident, guys. Fetty says... Batanga Sunrise. This is a beautifully crafted oil blend. Not to mention the scent. Okay. This was a collaboration between a fellow reviewer friend of mine, that metal guy in 1983, Stephen, and Fetty, over at Fetty Says. Look at that beautiful label. That is just, man, nice artwork. Look at that color of that oil. This is a very unique oil blend, guys. Very, very unique. And by accident, <clears throat> Fetty Boo Booed, and he uh, forgot to put the appleberry oil, appleberry oil that I put in for it with my order. And, but he did make a beautiful, like I said, beautiful mistake. He put the butter, and let me tell you what: Have you ever heard of a perfect mistake? This was it. Okay, he sent me the butter for Batanga Sunrise, and I didn't order it. He sent it to me, but he's nice enough to tell me, hey, man, uh, you know, sorry about that. I'll get it sent out to you as soon as I can, but I ran out of labels. So, you know, I mean, when you're doing custom labels like this, what Fetty does, man, it's some beautifully crafted stuff. It does take some time. So, you know, I was like, oh, that's cool. You know, no big deal. But I wanted to show you guys this butter. This is a different type of butter as well. Look at that. You can, you, can, you can tell I've been dipping into this. And I'm not a butter guy by any sense of the words. Like I said, beautiful mistake. I'll get into the ingredients here in just a minute. You can see. Look at that. Look at that. Just, just I didn't even barely touched it. And I'm already getting some in my hand. It is that damn good. Wow. Super banger. Boom. No words can compare. No. The, the, yeah. That good. Guys. This is phenomenally good. I, I can't say it enough. The profile on this scent is what intrigued me. You know, Stephen put together a really, what I would call super unique, super unique blend of scents. Now, we got tequila and cola, which, you know, when you open up the bottle, you're going to get that right up front. That tequila and cola, it's also got lime, cherry, and orange in it. Well, you get a little touch of the lime right in the beginning, just a little bit. And once it starts to do the dry down, that's when you get your cherry and orange. And then it's got some more little surprises in there. Just a couple. Like some cardamom, a little bit of clove, two different types of tobacco, and a pinch, just a pinch of cinnamon. Which I was like, really? That is just a super unique combination of scents and he did a fantastic Fetty just blew this one wow Batanga Sunrise guys he blew it out of the water without a doubt now the oil blend is the unique part <clears throat> I have used a few of these oils but two of them I have not so this was a definite got to test this for a while to see where we're at, you know, with the ingredients. Now, this has cacao oil, which I'm familiar with. Another company I work with also uses cacao oil. Now, the refined sesame oil is a new one to me. I, I had to do some little Dr. Google, find out if this was, you know, safe, number one, and what kind of... Uh, properties it had for the skin and the beard because you know it's in the butter and the oil and it was 
a very good, very good report. Google is a great resource, guys. I encourage you, if there is an ingredient you do not know about before you purchase a product, any product, doesn't matter if it's butter, oil, wash, conditioner, uh, bar soaps, deodorants, colognes, make sure you're not allergic to anything in it before you use it. Because 99% of these companies, including Fetty Says, will return your money with no problems if you are allergic to something in it. Fetty's cool like that. He ain't gonna, you know, if you're allergic, you're allergic. Just like a lot of the other companies, same way. I found out I was allergic to two different types of cassia oil. That's a problem. He put cinnamon in this, which most likely it was a cassia oil derivative. Um, I didn't have a problem with it. First time ever. <laughs> Thumbs up from me. He must have figured out a different source or something because this is, wow. Now it's also, like I said, it has cacao oil, refined sesame, uh, metal foam seed oil, which I'm very familiar with and absolutely love. Mami Sapote oil. M-A-M-E-Y-S-A-P-O-T-E. -E. Google it, guys. Mami Sapote oil. That is a new one for me. Also checked it out. Hemp seed oil, which I absolutely love in any blend. Doesn't matter which way you go. If it's got hemp seed oil in it, I'm going to try it. Because that's one of my favorites. And now, with the butter... This smooth as glass, smooth as glass butter, okay? It has that same oil blend, cacao oil, refined sesame, meadow foam, seed oil, mama sapote oil, hemp seed oil, and then on top of that, it has a butter that I have not used in it. It's got mango butter, da, da, da. a lot of folks use that. It's very, very, very hard to work with at times. You gotta be really good to work with mango butter. And avocado butter. Boom. I'm telling you fellas, this avocado butter is a game changer. I don't see why more guys are not using this. You know, more companies need to, you know, be bucking up, changing a little bit of their butter blends. And this is just Man, no wax, man. I love that. No wax. And let me tell you what. Pow. The feeling in beard for both the oil and the butter. It just, my beard, it's like for some reason it was like a, uh, my buddy Paul says it, <laughs> says it best. Yeah, my beard's a thirsty bitch, you know, and it's just like, it's, <laughs> My beard just sucks this stuff up. I mean, I've been pretty steady on this since last Saturday. And I've been testing it for seven straight days. Did not have one problem out of it. It absorbs. Didn't leave any rings on my shirt. Which a lot of butters do. You know, that's one of the reasons why I switched to either a liquid butter, unscented, or something of that nature. Or I don't use a butter at all at times because of my job anyhow guys that's the gist of it i want to throw you out some prices here <clears throat> the batanga sunrise combo is uh 32.50 and mind you guys this is a two ounce bottle not a one ounce two ounce bottle of oil 32.50 the butter also 32.50 now, he also has washes and conditioners. Yeah, washes are $22.99. Conditioners are $23. Bucks, you know, a big penny difference. Uh, he does have some other uh, prices. Uh, combo prices are a little different, of course. You know, he variates those based on the popularity of the product. You know, if it's a real popular one, it's going to be, you know, it's still going to be discounted, but it's not going to be at the level, like, say, for one that's, you know, maybe he's been... Uh, you know, going to be discontinued soon or anything like that. He does have some uh, varied prices. You see he's got a great layout on his website, which I will leave a link in the comments, folks. Leave a link in the comments. 
If you like what I put forth for you today, hit that like and subscribe button. Drop a comment. Send this around the world. Fetty says, keep your shiny side up, fellas. Catch y'all on the flip side.